Hello everybody and welcome back to Jurassic World the game! Have you done it? Cause I have, that's right, we have the Therizinosaurus Gen 2! But actually, we got more than just that to showcase. Why do we have no audio? Okay, let's open the packet silence. Yay! Look, we got Therizinosaurus. And we got... <laughs> oh, no, 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 it's not a restart. No, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. I remember what it is. Yep, there it is. I knew what, I knew what it was, because um, what I do is when I'm playing this on uh, mobile, and obviously it keeps the same, uh, like, settings and stuff, but what I do is I'll play this, and then I'll put a YouTube video over the top, because I got, like, YouTube Premium, so I can play my app games while also watching videos. I can kill two birds with one stone, it's great! <laughs> so, we have Therizinosaurus Gen 2. Now, I made sure. It actually wasn't too hard, I think, if you just got 1,500 cups or, like, 1,600 just to be safe. I had 1,700 and it was about four hours until it like clocked over three and it didn't change. I checked it like just before it was about to go over and they didn't go up anymore, the cups. So that was really good. Um, so we've got a herbivores. Uh, it should be near the back. There it is. So we've got Therizinosaurus and then Therizinosaurus Gen 2. Strangely enough, it doesn't really look too much like Dominion. <laughs> like, I was kind of expecting it to, you know, we've seen Jurassic World Evolution too, right? They've got the Therizinosaurus. But, uh, yeah, this one, I thought this was going to be the, the change of it. Maybe it'll look different when we get it in-game. But it is, in all regards, way better than the original Therizinosaurus, which it was always going to be because a tournament creature will always be better than a regular epic. However, epics are, um, epic. I'm oh, sorry, epic. But at the same time, um, they can, they, they're not too much worse than tournament creatures. And tournament creatures are only unlocked during a tournament. So we're going to hatch this. Now we do have two, we've got four free hatches to do. And let's have a look at you. Let's get a good look at your face. So yeah, that is very different to the Therizinosaurus from Dominion. Actually, if you don't look at the head, everything else is very similar. The coloring on the back, the like the lightish brown to the dark brown, that is that is Dominion's Thera. In fact, if you looked at that, you'd be like, oh, it is. And then you look at the face and you go, what happened? <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's very similar. Um, now I'm kind of in two minds whether we level this up to level 40. We will eventually need it when they make a hybrid, which they always do. Um, but, you know, whenever you get a, a, any sort of new dinosaur in the game, it's always better to get it to level 20. Because, I mean, this was basically free. I got 2,500 DNA for it. And I got a thousand bucks, I think it was. So, I mean, the thing is, if we do these in these videos, we've just got to unlock it anyway. Um, right, so what do we get? Like other Therizinosauridae, the Therizinosaurus Gen 2 are herbivores. Enjoying a healthy diet of foliage and vegetation, but not a balanced diet, and that's important, dear. You've got to have balanced diets. Also, oh, we got this. <gasps> we only need 270. 360, 90. Oh, maybe we could even get it. So now, if we go into here, you'll notice. Wait, do I have it? Oh, I've got something else to claim. We've got another pack. We have beta un. Well, not unlocked. That doesn't happen with these passes. We don't unlock the creature. We'll quickly jump back to Nublar. We'll go into here. We'll go into carnivores. And so we got a double friggin' whammy um, of beta. We actually have two two more blues e uh, even. Now because, is it, is it, hmm, is it a tournament creature? It looks like a tournament creature. Smells like one too, but it's a breakfast cereal. No, it isn't a tournament creature. Yes, it is different. But I'm thinking about, it's still only 250. We will instantly hatch it. I don't think that it would have... It probably would have been as long, if I'm going to be honest, actually. Put that right next to the Therizinosaurus. And now we have... Oh, we can get really close to beta. Now, how does it eat? Oh, so it does eat differently. Oh, okay. Interesting. So what they've done is they've taken the eating animation from Jurassic World Alive and put it over into Jurassic World the game. It has, like, a tiny little turkey that swings, which is very interesting. Uh, but it makes it one of the only carnivores in the game to not eat from the feeder. We can get that to level 10, 508 health, and 295 attack. Nope, not bad. Now, we can't get another one because it is not unlocked. Um, I think that probably is a way to to get it. Also, we should have another pack that we can open too. So, let's open this. Now, with these events, 
you can constantly grind for the points. However, the packs that you end up grinding aren't that great. Like, the rewards are pretty terrible, if we're going to be honest. Like, I mean, it's, it's free, I suppose, so it's not so bad. And the best thing you can get is a super rare. So it's pretty bad, um, especially for the amount of points it costs, like 700. When you think about it, 250 was enough to unlock another thing in the season pass. But 750 just to get one of these packs? I, that's a, that's a, that's a, that a hurts a real bad. <laughs> um, so we, I kind of want to level up the Therizentals because we can't level up uh, beta. So we're going to herbivores. And now if we go into the most expensive, we do have 141,000. Um, hopefully it's not too expensive. Yeah, it's only going to be 7,000. Is, is, is it going to be less? 7,000. So we actually have the Segno Sutures, which is very close to it. Ooh. Ooh. Actually, you know what? It has twice as much health and half the attack. So it's... It's kind of actually all right when it comes to being a herbivore. If it's, if it's against its weakness, like a flyer. Yeah, that is really good. It's carnivore, however, you're going to feel that reduction in your attack because that's going to take you to 275 or something ridiculous and you're not going to do much if we're going to be honest. Uh, so we do have two more instant hatches to use. Uh, so we do need eight of these buggers. So there we go. That's the cheapest that we can get. Uh, we can feed you. I do want to get it to level 40 because I'm very curious. Well, instant fuse. Yeah, we do have eight instant fuses, fuses as well. So because once you start doing the instant fusing, it now sets a timer. So in a week's time, they will all reset. So I need to remember, we should just fuse things. That's what we'll do. Uh, so we'll get this to level 20, 1,834 health and 246 attack. Also, we get to see this thing leveled up. And who doesn't want to see it level up? I know I do. Right, so 7,000. It's not too much of a hit. <gasps> Whoa, 1,344. Luckily, every time the tournament creature, you know, it sort of is is finished, um, they do reduce the cost. So it's it's actually reduced to about 160, I think. 160 odd. So, you know what? It is huge because we got to do this. In, oh, maybe I shouldn't have done it on beta. <laughs> But, you know, we got to do it. So now we can evolve that. We can instant fuse this and we can get it to level 30. Uh, so we do need to get another few more. We need to get four more. But, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good. So level 21 to 30, it has 2,260 2, health and 303 attack. Look at you. and Let's feed you. Yes. And at level 30, 2,795 2, attack health uh, and 394 attack, was it? 374. I knew there was a four in there. Uh, we'll quickly collect some of this, so we'll collect some of the food. Scientists increase the Gen 2 incubation period, resulting in a larger dinosaur. Therizinosaurus Gen 2 grows about three foot taller, or three feet taller, than their original counterparts. Isn't that interesting? Okay, well, it's 100. That's not going to really make a dent in how much this is costing. Uh, Therizinosaurus and Therizinosaurus Gen 2 are both characterized by their exceptionally large claws. Frightening. Yes, and I'm not going to look at the preview because we will get this. We will get this to level 40, and we'll do that. Oh, I guess, you know, I'm saving 160 each time, so I'm saving, you know, like five, five to six hundred bucks. You know, it's it's not so bad. I mean, it is bad, but as long as I can keep just over 10,000 bucks, I'll be happy. It's the DNA that really is the issue, but uh, so that is one, two, three, and the final one... You know what? It's not so bad because if I just get a good, um, what you call it? If I get a good, uh, trade, I can get 300 bucks back instantly. Uh, 230 do we need it. Oh, the Pteranodon is getting a bit antsy. Okay. But, uh, but, but, but. Perfect. Okay, but can I do it? I mean, that was one of the hardest ones. This was 230 max DNA, but we know that that's not the case. You can get higher if you're very good at the game. Uh, and hopefully it doesn't glitch for me. And it's like, no. Yeah, sometimes that glitches. I've never had the pressing the number one. Dino, baby's first dinosaur game. I've never had that one glitch on me. Oh, <laughs> okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah, I've never had this one glitch. Four, five, six. Yes! So it was 230 or something like that. And we got a whopping 395 DNA. Oh, that was interesting. Why is such an odd number? 
<laughs> I've got to have that five. So usually you get a cool limited offer. I say cool. Um, in this game, no, no limited offer this time. We could spend 7,000 bucks on one, two, three, four of these. Um, and we could... Uh, no, 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 no. Only thing is, with these packs, they do it deliberately. They make it cost bucks and you don't get bucks. So you can have twin carnivores. Uh, I mean, I guess if, if there was a lot of DNA to be had from these packs, then I might be tempted in one of them. Um, I mean, that maybe? And this is all food and coin and... Oh, 750? Actually, that's the best one for guaranteed. 5,000 bucks? Ooh! Wait, what's a sock? Okay, I was gonna say, what's a Sakasukas doing in here? What? You got it's like the Monolophosaurus, and randomly you just have Sakasukas at the end. Okay, collect some of that. You know why not? Why not? We still got some weeklies, which is the prize drop. <gasps> you know what? Let's do it. Let's spend. We're gonna spend. No, that's not the lottery. Here we go. So we'll, we'll buy ten of those, and of course, actually, we've still got all of these. So not bad. There's always little, little things, and that's what's good about Jurassic World, the game. There's little things you can do that, you know, if you know what you're doing, you're you're spending your resources wisely. It feels like in Jurassic World Alive, that's not the case. <laughs> it's like, if you're going to be spending your books, it's, you're never really saving. And the amount of books you get is absolutely minuscule. Um, so yeah, we'll just spend some of that. And now when we go in here, we can claim the 220, which just takes us over to now getting one of these card packs. And we spend... A couple of uh, maybe a thousand VIP points for 130 and food. Brilliant. <laughs> but we could, you know, we, we could get a Megalosaurus. We could get Turex Gen 2. Or more than likely, we're going to get food. Cool. Right. Okay. So, where was the Therizinosaurus? I just want to see if I got any good trades. Giganotosaurus for 219. Okay. I'll take that. Not going to trade that one. And there it is. 390. <laughs> There you go. That is beautiful. I love when we get something as good as that. Uh, we'll quickly go over to the Therizinosaurus and keep on a-popping. Right. So, we've got quite a few. I think that should be it, right? We'll just feed all these guys. I don't really care about food. L you know, you can get lucky in the trade harbors and you can get 30 million food for like 60 million coin. And that's way better than, uh, you know, grinding out. I mean, there's a reason why they implemented the, uh, the extra resource building for food as VIPs. Because it's another way to stall you. But if you get good trades like that, <laughs> who cares? <laughs> so we'll get you, yes, to level 30 instant fuse. Oh, I love it. Love. Gotta use inf instant fuses. Um, I really wish I would get some sort of extra points, though. Because I've, I've done this for so long. I've been a VIP member for so long, and I don't get anything. It should be at least every month you get, like, a good pack. I would at least maybe incentivize me to keep going. Otherwise, it's just, you know, keep all the buildings hostage, I suppose. <laughs> and the final fuse. Instant fuse. You see, I, I went quiet there. I don't know whether I cut that out. Hopefully I did. And you didn't even notice it went quiet. Oh, it has a tail. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah, I dig that. That's nice. Okay, so we'll get to level 40. Boom, 3,955 health and 530 attack at max level. Yes, you may squawk. And we get, you know, some bugs, some VIPs. Um, there is an source gen 2 uses its long arms to reach food in the trees. It's been noted that there is an source gen 2 seems to be less picky than the, than the there is an source when it comes to its choice of vegetation to snack on. Okay, I'm wondering if we go to Therizinosaurus if it says it is picky. Interesting things about the law there. I bet they haven't um, decided to put in any more, like, scientific quotes since that Jim Kirkland thing happened. <laughs> like, yeah, let's just no longer talk about paleontology anymore. It's just in case we end up looking stupid, we get caught with our pants down. <laughs> Yeah, do the aggressive. It's nice to see with some feathers. It's got to be honest. So there is a level 40. We do have beta. Uh, where is beta? Beta's right here, isn't it? Are you any good? I mean, let's have a look. We get... But beta and blue make a fierce mother-daughter duo. Beta is not only blue's baby, or she's also her identical clone. This is one team you don't want to mess with. I mean, you could easily mess with beta, let's be honest. You could kick it and then die. <laughs> and level four, evolution four... Yeah. What's this? Occasionally going after animals as large as a fully grown wolf. Oh, well, we never saw that. Oh, did we? Oh, wait, no, we saw it go after a fox, I think it was. I don't think it was a wolf. Maybe it was a wolf. Huh, can't remember. Anyway, 
At least somebody from Jurassic World team definitely went to see the movie. That's good. Right. Okay. So let's have a look. Let's see if we can see it. I mean, we want to see it in its most beautiful way possible. Um, but before we do that, <gasps> golden rewards. Oh, I was going to say, you little buggy. You. Could have. If I click back. No, I'm coming. All right. But luckily, I still had all of these to do. Um, like I did spend all of those, but <sighs> best thing here is carnivals, actually. Uh, so we'll go for Scorpius Rex, we'll go for Udon, and <sighs> we'll go for Interrupted Gen or Interrupted Level 40. We'll, we'll go for it. I don't think we really need it. Um, oh damn, Terradostro has a lot of attack. Oh god, okay. Um, Think we should be good? I'm just gonna go for loads of reserves now. Yeah, at that point, he could have had two and he could have killed me. It should go for four because I might only have two blocks. Yes! Oh, brilliant! No, Scorpius died. It. But Udon comes out to play. Right, one, two, three, kills it. And then two reserves? I mean, worst case scenario, it kills me. Um. And, I mean, what, it kills me with two? That's probably the worst case scenario. It's, it kills me with two. Um, oh, or it doesn't even do that. Right, so this is our biggest threat. We may as well go all out. I don't think we killed it. Oh, he did. It was just enough. And that's it. Yeah. So what would have taken two hits to kill me is now going to take two, four, six, four to kill me. So he's going to have to go to the, for his four out of five, leaving it with one block. And now Indoraptor with that 8,000 attack. Is this the most... Does it have the most attack of any dinosaur? He's actually right. It might do. I wonder. I wonder. Right, there we go. And whoosh! It was interesting because Jurassic World came out. Indominus Rex was like the best creature in the game. Fallen Kingdom came out. Indoraptor's the best. Dominion comes out. Where's Giga? Nobody be seen. Nobody. Because it wasn't. It wasn't a fierce dinosaur, I suppose. But, uh, oh, yes. Lots of DNA. I think it was 750 plus the Argentinosaurus that we could definitely sell. Um, also, one thing to do is I saw this in... I don't think I... I'm not going to make a video on it separately. I, I thought I was going to, but I'm not. Basically, I read an article where a kid paid money. Like, he must have went into the market, uh, into somewhere like here. And he paid for a certain dinosaur. Because you know they do the offers where it's like, get an Atrociraptor right now for £100 or something ridiculous. Um, it obviously wasn't that high. So the kid had bought this creature. And then he put it in the incubator. And what he unfortunately did, he put it in first. And the first creature you put in, you can't... Well, it's like you should never put something that takes ages in the first slot. Because otherwise, if you want to hatch other creatures, it's going to cost you books. Um, and unfortunately, he put it in the first slot and it was like 10 days or something. So not only had he spent real money to get the creature, this this young young kid, um, he'd also had to spend more real money in order to, you know, speed it up because they didn't have the books. Um, and it was just something that like, I, it's just like, it's not his fault or her fault or whatever. It's not the user's fault for making that mistake. It should be made more clear. Um, because then it's like, oh, well, I'm just stuck. I can't, if you have no books, then what are you supposed to do? I mean, you, I guess you could do missions and stuff like that, but you know what I mean? It's just, I was just like, ah, no, that sucks. And the the the, the father ended up making like a post on uh, Twitter or something like that, um, uh, just saying about how money hungry uh, this game is. And let's be honest, I played it this long. If there's any way, it's not that they're, I mean, they are money hungry, but it's not too bad in Jurassic World the game. Jurassic World Alive, because it's PvP, it's very bad. In this game, it's not so bad. So I'm going to speed up the Triceratops. I just wanted something in there uh, pretty quick. Uh, because now, I'm, I mean, I'm not going to play this game for until tomorrow, that's for sure. So if that, knowing that's the case, I may as well stick in a Eubocephalus. I could probably have stuck in an Epic or a Legendary, whatever you want to call it, for nine hours. And that way, I'm, I'm just using that as a way to harvest DNA. Now, what I do want to do is I want to go into... Uh, Sunazoic versus land. I want to find Beta. And it's. We're, we're probably going to have to scroll quite far, I'm thinking. Um, yeah, there's Toro at level 20. Oh god, where are you? There's Blue. Where's Beta? Uh, beta has 
more health, interestingly enough. Huh. You could do blue and beta, but really, I want to put beta out first. Or should we put beta out second? We'll put beta out second. Um. Oh, you know what we could do? Cenozoic and one of these. Uh, so, we'll get the Therizinosaurus. Now, where are you? There you are. Therizinosaurus Gen 2. So, it's better, technically, than a Stegoceratops. Wow, okay. So, we'll go for Therizinosaurus Gen 2. We'll go for... Uh, we'll go for, like, blue and beta. Because why not, you know? We've got to have the team. Uh, where are you? You're down here. There you are. Beta and blue, yes. Uh, now, what's the best thing? We want nullifying on the first one. Swap. What does this do? Prevent all swapping on enemy team. I, get, I mean, I think you have to be active for that one to take effect. Um, and then alpha. Increase attack stat of allied creatures by 100. Yeah, we'll put alpha on. And then we, we need a... Beta needs something that boosts itself. So, we could put regenerate. So, heal all hurt allied creatures by 25% of their max HP. So, if we put that on, beta at the end, like, every turn, everything will gain health. I think that's how that works. It's got that icon, so yes. It doesn't affect the dinosaur, but the rest of the team. Or we could do survival. Remain at 1 HP um, upon receiving lethal damage. I'm sure there's something in the code where it's like, if 1 HP equals true... Then this is negated sort of thing. Um, what's this? Siphoning bite. Heal 30% of the damage your creature deals. Ooh. Maybe not so bad. Steal. Steal opposing creatures mod. Terrify. Reduce attack stat of entire opposing team by 45. You know what? We'll need that. We'll need that just in case. That's my only one I've got. Let's do this right. Now, if we come up against any set of Oaks, we're just going to close the game. Because I don't think we will end up using those creatures. Um, no Cenozoaks. Okay, great. We're going to be in the best arena, the helipad. Yes. Okay, so we're going to nullify the, the bind, I think. Okay, so he's going to rally. Oh, okay. Oh, no. 20 attack. Ah. What's really good is that we're getting a boost onto... So am I unlocked? Or can I still not swap? I should be able to swap. Lower the attack 45% on Terrify. Oh, yeah. That's good. That's good. I still can't swap, however. Cool. <laughs> right. Um. Good news is that their best creature is that Rajas Stager. Everything else is kind of meh. Right. Here comes the Dino Swap. Okay. So, nullify. So, now everything's going to lose attack. Oh, no. Because it's already activated. Never mind. Uh, I'm... Yeah, I can go for two reserves. Easy peasy. You've only got two. You can't touch my Therizinosaurus. No. I mean, well, you can slap it like that, I suppose. <laughs> right, so you went for two. So one, two, three. Oh my god, it's not enough to kill it. I thought it would be. Damn. Okay, we're going to do some damage to it. We could swap out to beta or blue now if we want to. And I might be tempted to do that. Um, because I think he can kill me, actually. Oh, it's close. Damn, I think one more would have killed me. Yeah, one more would have killed me. Okay, so... I mean, I'm a bit worried about this. So I'm going to swap. I'm going to swap into blue. Oh, it disappeared. I was going to say it's the same glitch as the other thing, but no. Okay. Can I swap again? Oh, I can't swap again. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to go for three reserve. Yeah. I'm going to fodder off blue, I think. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, it's got five. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's going to go for it. It can definitely kill me. Yeah, there it is. Okay, now do we lose the attack boost? Blue, no. Yes, I think we did. Yo, yep, there it is. There it is. It's gone. Right, so... But the good news is it has nothing. So we're gonna go one, two, three, and then kill it. And then I need to make sure I survive here. I might fodder off beta as well. <laughs> kind of gonna have to. Uh, oh, I can't swap now, though. Even though I nullify it, 
Damn, okay. I didn't realize its attack was so low. Oh, it's swapping anyway. Oh, it's swapping to something I'm really good. I'm, I'm great against this thing. Okay. And it didn't go for anything. Okay, so no more health for you. Oh, it went for two. Out of its four, I think that was. I think. One, two, three. So it's got one block. So I'm going to go for one block and four reserves. Okay, he's got five. Two, four. Oh, God, this could, this could end horrendously for me. The team was just better. That team was so good. Oh, I think it's just got two block. I'm just, I'm barely clinging to life here. Right, but I got it this time. One, two, three, kills it, factor in two. And then I believe in, oh, okay, so it's got five. Um, even then though, I think it's gonna take a lot to kill me. It's gonna take one, two, three to kill me? He's only got five, so it's not a guarantee that he will go for the attack. Thank God tournament battles aren't this complicated, guys. Because <laughs> otherwise, it would take ages. Right, okay. I can't swap, so I'm just gonna have to go for it. Seven attack from the Therizinosaurus. In come the slashy slashy. Rabash! We didn't get a C beta. I'm sorry. <laughs> Actually, we could do another battle and see beta. Yeah, let's do another battle. We'll do another one and we'll see how beta does. Um, and we'll because we can. We've got like four refreshers. <gasps> but 50 Dimetrodon's not bad though. Right. Okay. So we're gonna put beta in first. So where are you guys? You're over here somewhere. Right, I've got three instant recoveries. Let's go. Okay, so... Beta. And then... Blue? And then something really bad. And then what we... Apparently, like, the nullifying makes no sense. So, what we should go for... Killer Instinct, what's this? Gain one action point per creature killed. Okay, spikes... After being attacked, deal 50% damage. Oh, you know what? Let's go for that one. And let's also increase our attack because I got 99 of these. Good God. <laughs> I've only got two in bigger race, but 99 of the other ones. I have 99 of all of them pretty much. Okay. No, no, no. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. I saw that. Cheeky bugger. Hopefully that doesn't count as me using my refreshers though. Like using the dinosaurs because it didn't load it fingers crossed please don't have done it don't do it you know you don't want to you make daddy beaver very angry if you do <gasps> oh damn it oh, okay 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 fine we'll just do beta um ah, fine 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 and i had to use spikes okay okay well if this one doesn't work and we get a Cenozoic. At least we get to see it, I suppose. Don't be a Cenozoic. We're low enough where it could be, though. Like, we use super high-level creatures. Oh, it's not. Oh, the gods are in my favor. Oh, it's brilliant. <laughs> Look how tiny she is. Oh, dear. Uh, Berserk. Okay. Increases the attack. Um, increases more attack. Okay. That's right, because we're going to increase our attack. Yeah! We can kill him one hit. Sweet. Do I get to go first, please? I'd love to go first. Yes? Ah. Well, actually, it doesn't matter what it does. Because I will kill it next turn. Because it's only going to have one. Unless it swaps. Maybe. I don't know what that shield one is on the Alangasaur, though. Okay, it goes for one. Right, but I do 50% damage, right? Because of spikes. Bam! <laughs> okay. I love how jank that was. That was brilliant. Okay, so he's only got 20... He's only got 26 on time. Oh, dear. Whoosh! It's a shame that Beta doesn't have, you know, more animations. It's basically just scaled down Raptor. It doesn't even have, like, one of its claws is, like, blunt. Just like it has in the movie, I'm pretty sure. I will have to just have a look at it, though. Its left one is sharp. I don't know about its right. If it was really faithful, it wouldn't be. Now, the 20 Alangasaur is a bit worrying because it's got a lot. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go for a block and a reserve. 
Yeah, not worried about that. Go for four. Please do. You know you want to. Go on. Go on. I want to see, like, I want to do Beta's, like, seven to eight attack animation and also win. Okay. So now I'm worried. Um, I'm killing one. So one, two, and then a block. Okay, I think that's all right. Wait, what? Armored hide? What does that mean? No! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I, I should have checked its mod. Okay, we've lost. Okay, well, th th there goes that, I think. Actually, wait, we might not have. I mean, it, we might not have lost, but it's, it's not looking good. No, Beta! <laughs> oh, it runs away? <laughs> so it doesn't die. That's interesting. Okay, spikes. <gasps> yes! Oh, it still killed it! What? That was amazing. Wow, Beta did it. I don't believe that. Now, normally Guanlong would have 14 attack, but because of the alpha thing, it had 140. <laughs> I don't think I've ever won with a level one Guanlong. Wow. Ah, you never can tell. But at least we got to see it's like dying animation, I suppose, because it's the same as is in Jurassic World Live. And that is going to have to wrap up the video. Um, Of course, when a new tournament creature comes out, we'll max it up or a new hybrid or a new update or whatever. You know, we, we still do play this game from time to time. But if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.